So today's topic is about oil pulling. I got this coconut oil. You can tell that I had it for a while. I got this from Sam's Club. It was, I think it was around $21. And it is the organic version coconut oil, cold pressed and unredefined. So I started looking up healthy, natural products to use. And I came across this thing that says use, um, oil pulling for your teeth. Now I have been using oil pulling for over a year and how it works is you put the oil in your mouth and you swish it around for like 20 minutes. So when I first start using it, I wasn't using toothpaste, toothpaste with it because they were saying the toothpaste had all kind of chemicals and you know, I really wasn't feeling you know how I usually feel. So I'm like, it's got to be these chemicals. But I did try oil pulling without toothpaste. And that did not work for me. So what I have to do, and I did have some toothpaste like uh, up in my gum area. And this melts in your mouth so it gets all up in, in there, you know, where the... Um, your toothbrush can't reach even when flossing and I you know been to the dentist and I think they I got pretty decent nice teeth but yeah so how you use this is you put the coconut oil on a spoon or whatever and you put it in your mouth for 20 minutes and you swish it around so you I set my timer on my phone and I wait for like 20 minutes <clears throat> then after that I don't spit it in my sink because it is oil. I don't spit it in the toilet. I spit it in the trash can because it is oil and you don't want your um, plumbing to be clogged up. So I spit it in the trash can and like I said, I swish it around for 20 minutes, spit it out and then brush my teeth for two minutes. And like I said, I had some pain over here in my mouth and after I start using the oil pulling, it did go away. So what they say about oil pulling, it's so many chemicals in um, in everything. And everybody said, oh, this is not healthy. That's not healthy. But when I, like I said, when I try to do the oil pulling with just the, with just the coconut oil, I can still feel residual. It didn't clean my mouth like I wanted it to be clean. You know what I'm saying? So I did have to use a toothpaste and I do use Colgate. So they're saying that use, it's so many things that's going on right now. Like all the chemicals we use is bad for our health, the food that we eat, nothing's good, nothing's good. So coconut oil pulling will help because like I said, I had soreness in my mouth. And I went to the dentist, I told him my mouth was hurting. And one thing I read about, uh, they was gonna try to put uh, fluoride after they cleaned my teeth in my mouth. I was like, don't give me the fluoride. And they was like, okay, because they were saying the fluoride is bad and it is condemned in so many countries, but they are still giving it to you at the dental office. Like I said, these are all my teeth. I don't have any fake teeth. Um, in and a lot of people when they start having mouth pains because it really does hurt because your mouth is so tender They start getting teeth pulled. They start pulling on themselves. I don't know but I'm here to tell you that I Had some tooth pain. I went and got that coconut oil From and it's organic coconut oil from Sam's Club I have been seeing some people online using some type of a coconut oil in a bottle. I guess they get it from Amazon because, yeah, they get it from Amazon because they try to use the Amazon code or whatever. But anyways, go to Sam's Club and get some organic coconut oil. Switch it in your mouth for like 20 minutes. Just hold it in there so it can get all up in there. And it, what it, they said oil pulling, it pulls out the bacteria, pulls out the germ. And you can... You can feel like products like this hitting in your, even if you floss, it's hitting in between your teeth. You can, when you swish and you can start feeling that even after you had brushed your teeth or whatever. But uh, do this before you brush your teeth. 
and then so you can get all of that oil out too and don't swallow it because i was like if it's oil it's probably good for your insides but when i swallowed it i would i didn't really feel that good so don't swallow it spit it out into a trash bag and not into your sink because it'll clog up it is oil and don't say i keep repeating the same thing but i just want you to know that coconut oil oil pulling is what i recommend it's what i've been using and i think i have pretty you know natural uh white because it cleans you know what i'm saying so i recommend the coconut oil pulling before you brush your teeth don't use the alcohol um listerine all those alcohol products don't use those alcohol products because they will they it's just too many chemicals for one thing so coconut oil brush your teeth and don't use listerine especially if you have oil because if you have a uh, oral problem because one thing about the the more chemicals you use the more you're messing up your natural uh body uh floral your your natural bacteria but this some something organic is pretty safe now, like I said, I use Colgate. Some people say don't use Colgate. Use Tums or use. I did order some, um, what you call natural white. It was um, charcoal. I couldn't get into that charcoal because it, you know, it was like sp I was spitting black stuff all out all everywhere, and I was spitting it in the trash can. But I don't know. It was irritating my gums, so I couldn't do the charcoal. But I can do that oil coconut because it's natural product so it's not going to hurt you can cook with it anything that can go in your stomach and not you know go in your stomach is pretty safe for you so that's what i recommend if you have any oral problems i'm trying to be clear as i can because i've seen other people say don't um brush your teeth with toothpaste because of the chemicals but i had to so it's like you can use this in conjunction with that and you'll still have you'll still be okay so that's what i learned from my personal use but you could try it for yourself all right have a good day